Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to be talking about a new tweak off of the Big Boss repo called Super Switcher. It is only 99 cents and it is made by someone who usually makes good apps here. And it requires iOS 4.2 or higher, so make sure you meet those requirements. And it only works with the iPhone and iPod Touch. So what this does is it actually lets you have about nine apps favorited you're going to be able to click the multitasking go into the multitasking mode which is double tapping the home button and up top there you're going to have nine of your favorite apps of your choosing as you see in the picture right here but first i would like to show you what this does so let's double tap on the home button and as you see here i have many of my favorite apps up here my device currently doesn't have many apps so i just put some random apps up there to show you guys and the top slider, if you slide to the right, that controls the volume, I mean the brightness, and the bottom one controls the volume. And you can also control your Bluetooth, your location services, your Wi-Fi, and airplane mode straight from your multitasking mode. So let's go back here and let's go over the settings. Yes, there is settings for this. This is where you're going to set what apps you want to have on your multitasking mode. So we have up to nine applications here, one through nine. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you a quick example. So if I go down, I'm going to choose an app. The bottom, Down at the bottom is the user applications, but while up top you have your system applications. So I selected my first app right there, which would be on the top left. And I choose, uh, choose my second app right there, which was Flipboard. So let's go ahead and go back now and let's see if those apps appeared. So there we go, and those apps did appear, so it worked successfully. And overall, impressed with this. So if you guys have any questions, I'm going to ask you to leave them in the comments below. And remember to like and subscribe. And if you would like to learn how to get this tweak for free, then in the description below, follow the YouTube video guide, and I'll show you how to add a .deb file into your iPhone or iPod's file system using a file editor.